Right, little video update going on from the Three Saga a few days ago. Um, right, for anyone that isn't aware, um, got my wife a phone from Three. A few days later, within the 14-day uh, sort of cooling off period, um, the screen on it broke. So took it back to the shop, but the shop in uh, Torquay 3 store were really dismissive to the point where they were actually bloody rude. Um, I checked with customer services online beforehand and they said, yep, yeah, put back to the store, they'll be able to sort you up. But I went there and staff refused to help me. Spoke to customer services on the phone, they said they should help me, they spoke to the staff. It took fucking ages. Anyway, got past through loads of different people on the telephone at 3. One person said they can help me, the next person said they couldn't. Three and a half fucking hours I spent on the phone, contradicting myself, the people, list of people contradicting themselves, um, <laughs> being told, yes, we can help you, send it back, no problem. Speak to someone else, no, sorry, we wouldn't do that. It absolutely took the piss. So I created a video like this one, posted it on YouTube, shared it on Twitter. Within minutes, I had someone from the online help team, a fella called Alan. Um, from the social media team contacted me apologizing um, as a way of apology they've cancelled um, all of my contracts with three because that's what I said I wanted to wash my hands with them they were useless um, and they're taking the phone back here it is going back didn't have to come to this did it three and we also realized while going through it that the staff in the store had set my contracts up inappropriately they'd set me up on two different contracts and they'd staggered the start of dates would have tied me in for 26 months into 24 cheeky twats so, anyway, what started out as me just wanting to return something that was faulty for exchange ended up with me leaving the company completely. Didn't need to happen, did it, Three? Didn't need to come to this point. Thank you to Alan from that team, who is um, the only person I spoke to who saw sense and was willing to see the whole thing through. Um, to everyone else that I dealt with, everyone that contradicted the previous person that I spoke to, you're a serious professional letdown. <clears throat> what should have been a really easy fix, a really easy <coughs> in-store apology, swap it over, let's send this back to the manufacturer and see what's wrong with it. Staffing talkie were just pricks. So <coughs> for anyone contemplating getting a new mobile phone, taking out a, a contract or anything like that, avoid three. I would because their after sales service is absolutely shockingly shit. Um, if you are with three and you need to achieve anything, with them and you're not getting very far, slate them on social media, because that way you get put through to decent people. Um, and if you are looking for a new deal or anything like that, avoid three in Torquay like the plague. Anyway, peace out, I'm off to the post office.